You can now connect multiple sets of input signals to your Simulink model to help set up your simulations. By testing your models in this way, you keep the input signal data separate from the model you would like to test. The first step is to create the signal data that you want to use as input signals for your model within the MATLAB workspace. Then open the Root Import Mapping tool, which you can do by clicking Connect Input from either Configuration Parameters or one of the Root Import blocks in your model. From here, import all the input data that you would like to connect to your model. You can view each signal you imported to ensure that it looks the way you want it to. Repeat this process to create multiple data sets to use as input signals for your simulations. Then map the input signals to the model and save the root import mapping scenario so that you can access it later. Select one of the data sets that you've created and click Mark for Simulation to apply that data set to your next simulation. Now when you run the simulation, Simulink will use these input signals as the stimulus to the model. When the simulation ends, you can analyze the simulation results just as you normally would.